Here's a drill I like to teach players how to hang the dribble and get more steps with less dribbles. So I'm just gonna start with an in and out or a curl and I'm just gonna float. I'm gonna get there off that one dribble. So I'm starting at the free throw line. I can do whatever move and then I'm just, you see how I let it hang. I didn't freak out. I let it hang. I gathered in a finish, okay? So many players, especially junior high, high school players, they feel like every time they take a step, they have to dribble. That's how it was in the 70s, it's not like that anymore, okay? So we can't get left behind thinking that every step requires a dribble. I can go off a cross or stick with my in and out and I'm just, you see how patient I was getting my hand under the ball. That's where your steps start to count. As Soon as my hand comes under the ball, now it's picked up. When my hand is on top or on side of the ball, that's not picked up so the steps don't start counting until I either turn my hand under or we bring it to two hands.